Boom. Let's do it again. Kamigawa. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. To our new regular box openings. We're going to be opening tons of stuff. Didn't already know. Make sure you check out the link in the description to our bundle. It's the best deal we have in our entire eBay store. Um, $50 bundles with tons and tons of rares. Uh, all sorts of foils, mythics, and booster packs as well. Um, all sorts of other surprises in there also. S pretty much exclusively for our YouTube subscribers. Because we don't really advertise the bundles anywhere. But anyway, we are back to hunting for neon ink i am really really wanting to pull some neon ink or a showcase wandering emperor beautiful land right there mountain oh that's pretty cool all these art cards are so cool sorry captain coiling stalker all right here we go into the rares March of Swirling Mist. Pretty cool. The Warlord. The Penitent Warlord. Crucible of Defiance. And Eater of Virtue. Pulled quite a few of this card. Inventive Iteration, no showcase, nice little rat rogue. These cards, the quality of the cards, the print, quality control, really good. I've enjoyed opening the very little that I've opened so far. Um, we have a lot of fun stuff coming up. I can't wait for Double Masters. We are going to open a lot. We're going to grade a lot of cards. It's going to be a great time. Really looking forward to it. We're in full swing. We're going hard. We're going hard into the magic sector. There's a lot of stores who are scared and kind of afraid to just go for it. Another Crucible of Defiance. But we are embracing this weird market right now. And we're not we're not going to miss out. Because I think every, a lot of people are going to look back at this era of cards and regret not buying wow look at the art on this mirror box really cool showcase extended i think there's going to be a lot of uh people who regret not buying and missing out on this era of stuff um there's just so much toxicity and fear and uh man I just like, I like, I like a lot of this stuff. I think it's going to age pretty well. That's just me. So I'm embracing it. We are staying the course. Kura, the Boundless Sky. Really cool card. Not the best dragon mythic, but not terrible. Send an Acolyte. The Dragon of Kami Reborn. Boom. That's a good mythic. There we go. I think the show this uh showcase version is like 20 25 bucks, something like that. It's not the Phyrexian text one, but we'll take it. Wow, look at the art on this card. Pretty amazing. For the extended, the showcase foil. Not not super expensive, but just absolutely beautiful. Absolutely a beautiful card. All right, let's get something expensive. I really love the Wandering Emperor showcase foil. Um, but yeah, the, those neon ink cards. Let's do it, huh? 
These packs are so hard to open and I really have to be careful not to damage any of the cards, just in case. It'd be terrible to end up damaging one of the cards I want to grade, you know? Because we're going to pull it. I'm going to do this until we get one. Either a Neon Ink or the Wandering Emperor. Surge Hacker Mech. Commander. Spirit Sisters Call. Not really the mythic we're after. Jugand, a defender of, defends the temple. Ooh, there we go. Kaito Shizuki. Pretty cool. Extended foil. Mint condition. This is probably like a $20 card, I think. I know the normal version's like eight. Pretty good, pretty good, okay, okay. But we're gonna need to pull something much bigger than that just to break even on this box. Let's go, can we do it? Can we do it? It's all about the hunt. Hunting for these cards is the fun part. Soul of Kamigawa. Organic Extinction. March of Burgeoning Life. Koto's The Silent Spider. And wow, back to back. Ah, oh, sigh. Where are all the monster poles? What are the poll rates on these? Anybody know? Are there numbers out on the odds for the neon ink yet? Per box? I have no idea. I'm just going completely blind. I had to wait a little bit for the prices to come down on these boxes. Because that's just how I do it. I don't... I don't buy them right when they come out, when the prices are at their peak. I kind of wait for them to come down. So I got these, finally waited, got these boxes for $185. And uh, I'm happy with that price. $185 a box. And now we go hunting. Go hunting for these cards. Mirror box. Satori Umezawa. Pretty cool showcase and whoa an etched foil tezzeret betrayer of flesh really cool looking i have no idea what this is worth but the foiling on it is nice it's off center but really cool no idea if that's a big hit or not I have not opened enough of this yet, but all right. Let's hope that's worth something. Let's go though. Let's go. I'm feeling it. Wandering Emperor right here. Wandering Emperor. Lizard Blades. Chisoro, the Shattering Blade. I'm guessing that's terrible. Wow, March of the Swirling Mist. Really cool art. Grease Fang Obika Boss. A little rat pilot. That's a really. I like that card. And. Oh, Light Paws Emperor's Voice. Man. Awesome artwork, though. I love the fox. Legendary Creature Fox. Really cool. Saw Emperor on there. I thought it might be the Wandering Emperor when I pulled it real fast. Wasn't meant to be. I told I was feeling an Emperor. Just the wrong one. Man, these packs, I'm telling you. Just a lot of glue. Too much glue. Boom, forest. The Kami War. Rampant Rejuvenator. Lizard Blades again. This box feels not good so far. 
Surge Hacker Mech, and another Kotos Silent Spider. Holy moly. I think we're going to Hose Town on this one. Boy, this feels awful. This feels awful. Of course, I don't know anything. I could be completely wrong about a lot of these cards. The Restoration of a John Doe. Drum Bellower. Blade of the Oni. Not sure about that one either. Doesn't seem like a good mythic. Fable of the Mirror Breaker. This card's like 10 bucks. I know that. Oh, okay. Odawari, so Odawara, Soaring City. I think this is like a $30 card, 25 bucks. Uh, extended foil. Might be like 20, 25, something like that. Pretty good card though. Nice legendary land there. Okay, okay. Three packs left. Need a couple more, uh, need a couple more hits. Need a showcase. we need I really want the wandering emperor I really do seven tail mentor I like the fox samurai is in here okay the soul ripper uh the swift reconfiguration it's like the commander set weaver of harmony blade of the oni again for a Double tap of this mythic. And what do we got? Lion Sash. Womp womp. Two packs left. Good luck to us. Make sure you subscribe, guys. We have a lot of good stuff coming. Double Masters is going to be off the chain. We're gonna be opening a lot of it every single day. We're gonna have videos every day, starting at release. And uh, we're gonna pull some massive pulls and we're gonna give away a lot of cards. Check out those bundles, link in the description. Can't go wrong. Another Silent Spider, I think we have four. That's too many for, for one box. Storm's Edge, March of Reckless Joy. I mean, the art on this is pretty sweet. But it's not very exciting. Not very exciting. Let's go. Last pack in the close. We need some neon ink. We need some neon ink. Daddy needs some neon ink. Let's go. The trainee. Subduer. Sorry, Commander. Unquenchable Fury. Okay, bunch of heads. Reality Architect. Weaver of Harmony. And come on, this is going to make or break this box. Whatever this card is. Oh my goodness. Ogre Head Helm. Terrible. Terrible. Feel like that box, unless this Tezzeret is worth something, was just a slap in the face. Man, it is tough to pull some, some good cards out of here, but we are not giving up. We'll be back tomorrow to try and get this Wandering Emperor or the Neon Ink. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like this video, maybe put an F in the chat to pay respects. Because this box was just a total bloodbath. Anyway, thank you. We'll see you next time.